Hi, I'm uh, Nicolas Tahon, chairman of Deloitte Belgium, and uh, I've been involved in Fast 50 for many years, since the start. And today I will speak with Joris van der Gucht, CEO of Silverfin, as I was uh, well uh, involved in the uh, corporate venturing since the start with uh, Silverfin and Joris. Hi, uh, my name is Joris van der Hucht. I'm one of the founders of Silverfin. Silverfin is a B2B SaaS company in the fintech world. Uh, especially, we've developed a data hub that automates the work for accountants, tax consultants and advisory. And today I'm here to talk about uh, corporate venturing together with Deloitte. Hi everyone, with us today we have Joris from Silverfin and Nicolas from uh, Deloitte. Welcome gentlemen. Thank you. I know that you both have very busy agendas, so we really appreciate you coming here. You probably came from London and you, Nicolas, home game Rotterdam. from <laughs> Metteren, voila. <laughs> now gentlemen, you both lead very strong, important organizations. What brought the two of you together, Joris? Well, uh, in my opinion, maybe it's fair to say that uh, both companies have uh, actually a very entrepreneurial spirit. So I still remember the early days where we maybe we just were a 10 people company mm -hmm. where we started to work together. Like the, the, the belief in a startup from the Deloitte side, the, the eagerness to learn from each other and the entrepreneurship on both sides is actually, in my opinion, something that brought us together. Yeah, and I would add to that, uh, Joris, that uh, your passion from the first days was uh, really uh, amazing. Uh, you know, in Deloitte Accountancy, uh, because that was the start of our venturing, uh, it's, it's rather a traditional uh, compliance yeah. business in the core. Uh, and uh, yeah, of course, we are really experts in, in, in everything that has to do with uh, financial statements, with accountancy, with tax, with VAT. But we are not technology guys and, and we are not really used to think in terms of, um, well, client experience uh, when it comes to technology and uh, in processes when it comes to technology. And that was your passion. Yeah. And, and yeah, it was uh, rather uh, impressive how you really focused on, on a big part of our compliance process. And, and you convinced us that you were going to really um, make it much more easy, much more collaborative, and, and, and that you would increase the experience for our accountants uh, to, to work together and to work in, in that technology. And uh, so it was your passion that uh, motivated us to, to, to start this uh, corporate venture. What a compliment. So yeah. you were actually the one that triggered and inspired Deloitte then. Yeah. Now, what could we actually say is the essence here of this corporate cooperation? Well, maybe from my side, I think the essence is that uh, both companies actually are in a, or, or are working together on a digital transformation. Eh? So I do think the industry is changing. Eh? We were talking about the compliance processes, uh, the financial statements delivery, uh, the added value that a technology company can bring to the, the expertise of uh, an house such as Deloitte, the digital transformation that we're going through, that's in my opinion the essence of our collaboration. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I, I believe that, um, well, the digital transformation, of course, in, in, in our compliance services yeah, is, is uh, important and, and God thanks that we have started this digital transformation uh, about uh, I don't know, 10, 12 years ago, not with Silverfin in the beginning, but since uh, five, six years with Silverfin. If we would not have done this, well, the, the pandemic we are uh, cruising through would have had um, tremendous impact on our business, on our collaboration with clients, on the collaboration uh, between, between the colleagues. Now, the digital transformation did not start to prepare a pandemic, but it started because, yeah, it was a disruptive factor and that's a disruption part. And on the other hand, I believe um, the real added value comes from, uh, well, the way we could combine uh, within an accountancy compliance and accountancy and tax compliance team, mm. expertise from different people, uh, that is facilitated by 
the technology today. Mm. And previously that was in the heads eh, of, uh, of our experts and um, it was not always easy to find the right expert wherever in the country, wherever in the teams. Today, thanks to the technology, we can bring very easily all these expertise together and, and they work on the same documents, on the same working files. They, they, they can collaborate whether they are in, in, yeah, today whether they are in Ghent or in Zaventem. No, today whether they are in Ghent or Portugal or India, it doesn't matter anymore. And, yeah. and, and that's uh, for me the real uh, important uh, added value that our collaboration has brought to Deloitte. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And maybe that comes back to the essence because that's correct in my opinion. Like the, the potential disruption of the industry, like yeah. I do think we have a shared mission then. Eh? Yeah. So yeah. we really want to transform this industry. Yeah. We see lots of added value if this industry changes. Eh? So then it's not a, a disruption, then it's really an opportunity for yeah. this industry. Eh? Sure. And that's where the expertise and the technology work really hand in hand. Yeah, and I'm, I am sure that finally our goal as, as Deloitte accountants, as Deloitte tax, is to increase the value to our clients. Yeah. And you can do that by bringing together that expertise, as I already said, but also, yeah, we just can offer a lot of, of better solutions, yep. much more integrated solutions to our clients. Mm. We can think about, yeah, insourcing the financial departments of our clients. And even if we are not together in the same office, no, no, but we are on the same platform and okay. that's much more important today uh, than, than, than yesterday. And the platform is what really makes the difference. And there, Silverfin and Juris, his team, they are the experts in the platform and we are the experts in the content. Yeah. And bringing that together has been, until now, and we will work hard to, to continue uh, like that, has been a success. Yeah, a great synergy. Now, already heard common ground and uh, having a uh, uh, a mutual objective is a very important core value. What would you suggest or think are other core values that you need to make this a success? I think we're both still in a, a relation business. So uh, the relation side, understanding each other, talking with each other, like it starts with, with that. A good basics. partnership starts yeah. with these basics, eh? definitely. Yeah in my opinion, in the B2B world. So as much as we want uh, our firm believers both in technology and the value of that, like, sometimes you need to be able to look each other in the eyes and, and, and discuss topics. Eh? So I do think that's the fundament of a good relation as well. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Because next to working together uh, on, on the same platform, we also have, well, worked together to, to um, well, to build. Eh? Um, content that Silverfin can market in their markets. Uh, and, and that was an, another phase in, in our corporate venturing. And yeah, then you come in a new ball game, of course, because then we are delivering mm -hmm. uh, uh, content, the product to, to Silverfin. They are marketing, marketing it. And of course, th that needs other ways of collaboration, but also another agreement. Yeah. And uh, that was not our base experience it was not your base experience to work together with oh. a company like ours yeah there were hurdles on the road and we need we have uh, we have had uh, time and sometimes difficult discussions but i believe we, we 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 have been able to solve them because at the basis i believe in such a corporation it's like everywhere and uh, always you need trust yeah. And if, if you have trust amongst each other and, and, you, and you understand the goals of, of the two companies, uh, we need to understand what the objectives and what yeah. the, 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 the rhythm of, of evolution of Silverfin is. And they need to understand yeah, what some values and, and, and quality sometimes uh, and, and some hurdles are of a company like ours. If you can explain that to each other and you listen to each other and you try to, to to really get into the world, uh, each other's world, and, and have a relationship of trust, I believe you can 
solve a lot of, of hurdles and yeah. you can be very successful in the long term. That's a nice message. Maybe to iterate on that mm. content delivery piece, because that co is going back maybe to my first point, the entrepreneurial spirit that both companies have. We are actually doing something or have been doing something that's quite unique for the industry for the first time. Mm. Mm. So by doing that together, by learning from each other, by understanding each other, by taking loads of hurdles, like we were saying, like actually that entrepreneurial sp spirit, sorry, is really important to achieve that. Yeah, okay, I see. Now, we can look back at already a very successful journey. Eh? Um, now, more looking forward, what do we uh, what do we see as a next phase? Eh? It started off focusing on the Belgian market. What will be next? I think we have uh, together quite a lot of opportunities ahead of us and we start to prove that in the network. I think today we are working together with uh, six or seven member firms uh, already globally. So we start to uh, see that traction in the network and, and therefore it was important as well to build that credibility, that trust together from, from the Belgian base. Uh, so uh, the opportunity that we have together ahead of us is can be really amazing. Uh, we're transforming not only from the user experience side mm -hmm. in industry, but as well from that content side. Uh, we have potentially a global opportunity ahead of us to, 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 to bring together the expertise to bring together the technology and for the first time build that in a, a very digital offering. Yeah, so that's, I do think, an amazing opportunity for uh, both companies that we have uh, ahead of us. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I fully agree, Fam. We started with Deloitte Accountancy, then I believe uh, Silverfin has done a great job uh, in our European Compliance Center, uh, building uh, a solution uh, named Bridge Your Gap, uh, yeah. uh, really an offering to pan-European corporates uh, for all their compliance uh, uh, challenges when it comes to financial statements and tax returns. For Deloitte Tax, uh, they have built uh, an important, and we have built together, an uh, important tax module. Yeah, there, there are quite some opportunities to export uh, that, that uh, way of working. And having said that, yeah, we are thinking as Deloitte on um, how can we, in the future, how can we organize ourselves uh, to become uh, a more dominant player when it comes to operate models, to really yeah, being involved in, in, in the financial operations of, of our clients and of, of larger uh, corporates um, and complex organizations. Yeah, it's clear that uh, strong collaboration with an ecosystem, eh? Silverfin is an, is, is an important uh, player in the ecosystem, but there are others uh, with other solutions then, uh, complementary solutions. Well, this, this is very important for a company like ours mm. because at the end, we are not a technology, a software company. We are a content expertise driven company. They are a software technology company and combining that it, it remains very valuable for the future. Yeah, I can imagine. And, and now maybe looking at it from a different angle, more the corporate versus the startup scale up. What would you say is the added value to Deloitte? Uh, because you're working with, uh, with a scale up and, and, and vice versa. What had this, has this brought as, as added value? Well, for me, it's important that when you, you choose for a, a partnership eh, uh, as a corporate company or as a large company like ours, you should do that because you really believe in the added value of the partnership and you need to create a win-win situation. And whether it is with, a, yeah, with another large company like SAP or Salesforce mm -hmm. or whether it is with a scale-up and, and fast-growing company, when you are convinced about uh, well, the quality, the professionalism, the, the end goal, the values of the company, then, uh, well, this collaboration can bring a lot of added value. You know from the start that you will have to solve quite a number of, of problems and hurdles. But the, if the, fundament, the fundamentals are okay, you will do that. And, and then you can go a very long way. So for me, the added value is also the agility of uh, a startup. It's also sometimes a pitfall. Eh? They need to, to really be <laughs> able to, to scale eh? their yeah. resources, their operations. Yeah. Yeah. That's sometimes uh, also a challenge, uh, yeah, Jürgen, but okay. And then you have to talk to each other and, and, and the passion, the drive, and continuously yeah, their focus on making our uh, compliance life more easier, more uh, solution-driven, more 
uh, oriented on, on bringing added value to the market. So yeah. that, okay. that's, I believe, the, the real uh, value. Yeah, well, I agree 100% with, with that reasoning. And challenging our ag agility has been, it has been something that Deloitte has been done very well over the past two yeah. years. Eh? Because in a growing company, you built everything from scratch, basically. Yeah. You have a, a, a relation uh, with a Deloitte that has an amazing positive impact on our business eh? yeah. in terms of trust of our own brand. But obviously, we need to scale. Eh? So that means that agility is great to have in the early days, and we still need to have that. But bringing more processes on delivery, quality, yeah. and so yeah. on and so on. So like actually for us as well, that has been a, a great learning curve and, and a, in a way a great experience for us. So a good challenge yeah, indeed. Yeah, exactly. Okay, yeah, yeah. perfect. This was, this was very insightful. Many thanks to the both of you and goodbye.